Huawei's Harmony OS has made a groundbreaking leap, unseating Apple's iOS to become China's second-largest mobile operating platform. In the first quarter, Harmony OS surged to a 17% market share, overtaking iOS for the first time in the world's largest smartphone market. But what does this shift mean for the future of mobile technology in China and globally? Could this signal the rise of a new dominant player in the operating system market? Keep watching as we uncover how Harmony OS reached this significant achievement and discuss its potential impact on the tech landscape. Huawei Technologies' mobile operating system Harmony OS has surpassed Apple's iOS to claim the second largest position in mainland China during the first quarter, according to the most recent market data from CounterPoint Research. In this period, Harmony OS captured a 17% market share, marking the first time it has outpaced iOS in the world's largest smartphone market. The growth was driven by robust domestic demand for Huawei's latest 5G smartphones, which fueled adoption of the company's self-developed mobile operating system, as indicated by CounterPoint's data. Harmony OS, officially unveiled by Huawei in 2019, was developed as a versatile operating system capable of running on a wide array of devices from smartphones to I.O. devices. Its architecture is designed to facilitate seamless communication between different types of hardware, positioning it as a unique competitor in a market dominated by more specialized operating systems. Harmonios uses a distributed technology that allows developers to create apps for multiple device types simultaneously, promoting a unified ecosystem. By March 2021, it was reported that Harmony OS had been installed on over 100 million devices, reflecting its rapid adoption rate. This initiative is part of Huawei's broader strategy to enhance its independence from Western technology infrastructures and reduce its vulnerability to external pressures such as trade bans. Despite U.S. sanctions, Huawei experienced significant growth for Harmony OS domestically, with its market share more than doubling from 8% in the first quarter of 2023. This surge was driven by Huawei's re-entry into the 5G handset segment through its Mate 60 series smartphones last year. Meanwhile, Apple's iOS slightly lagged behind with a 16% share, while Google's Android maintained its dominance in the market with a 68% share during the same period. CounterPoint indicates that Harmony OS share is anticipated to expand further as Huawei emphasizes supply chain localization. Globally, Android and iOS maintained their lead in the March quarter with shares of 77% and 19%, respectively. Harmony OS held a 4% share worldwide during the same period. In May 2019, Huawei was placed on the U.S. entity list, which restricted the company's access to American technology and services, including critical software and components necessary for smartphone production. This move was part of broader geopolitical tensions between the U.S. and China particularly concerning technology transfer and cybersecurity issues. Despite these challenges, Huawei accelerated its development of Harmony OS as a strategic pivot to reduce its dependence on U.S. technologies, particularly Google's Android OS. The sanctions spurred Huawei to increase its collaborations with domestic chipmakers and software developers to sustain its smartphone production and software needs. By developing an independent supply chain, Huawei managed to not only sustain but also grow its market presence in China amid restrictions. This defiance has been marked by significant milestones, such as the doubling of Harmony OS's market share within a year, demonstrating resilience and strategic foresight in navigating global trade challenges. These efforts underscore Huawei's commitment to maintaining its competitive edge and securing its position in the global market despite external pressures. The increasing adoption of Harmony OS domestically demonstrates Huawei's successful strategy in developing an alternative to Android, overcoming the challenges posed by U.S. government-imposed tech restrictions since the company's addition to Washington's entity list. Under the trade blacklist, Huawei is prohibited from purchasing software, chips, and other U.S. origin technologies from suppliers without approval from Washington. Huawei launched Harmony OS in August 2019. Initially, early versions of Harmony OS faced criticism for closely resembling Android. However, the latest iteration, Harmony OS Next, released as a developer preview in February, shows significant divergence from competing operating systems. Harmony OS Next will no longer support Android-based applications. Huawei's strategy to mitigate the impact of international restrictions has been multifaceted, focusing heavily on R&D and localizing supply chains. Since the inception of Harmony OS, 
Huawei has invested significantly in research and development, allocating billions annually to innovate and refine their technologies. This investment aims to ensure that Harmony OS not only competes with, but also exceeds the functionality of its counterparts. A critical part of this strategy is Huawei's commitment to developing proprietary technologies, such as their own semiconductor designs through High Silicon, their chip-making subsidiary. This move has allowed Huawei to produce smartphones that are less reliant on foreign technology and more tailored to the specific needs of the Chinese market and its regulatory environment. Furthermore, Harmony OS's ability to operate across multiple device platforms, including wearables and smart home devices, exemplifies Huawei's vision of a fully integrated technological ecosystem. This broad applicability is crucial for achieving compatibility and efficiency across Huawei's extensive product line reinforcing its competitive edge in a tightly contested market. Huawei intends to debut Harmony OS, next with the Mate 70 series flagship smartphones later this year. As stated by rotating chairman Eric Xu Zhijin in May, Harmony OS Next, the latest iteration of Huawei's operating system, showcases significant advancements in terms of security and functionality. Released as a developer preview in February, this version has been engineered to be entirely independent of Android marking a significant shift in its developmental approach. Harmony OS Next introduces enhanced security features that are built to cater to the growing demands of data protection in an increasingly interconnected world. Additionally, it offers improved user interface elements that are designed to provide a more intuitive and responsive experience across a range of devices, from smartphones to smart home systems. This strategic upgrade is aimed at boosting Huawei's competitiveness in the global market particularly in regions that are sensitive to data sovereignty concerns. Looking ahead, Huawei's plan to integrate Harmony OS next into their upcoming Mate 70 series flagship smartphones indicates their ongoing commitment to innovation. These high-end devices are expected to showcase the full capabilities of Harmony OS next from increased processing speeds to advanced AI functionalities, setting a new standard in smartphone technology. This move is poised to strengthen Huawei's position in the premium market segment, appealing to consumers seeking cutting-edge technology and performance. According to CounterPoint, Huawei emerged as the top performer among all major smartphone vendors in mainland China in the first quarter, with sales increasing by 69.7% year-on-year. This outstanding performance was largely credited to Huawei's successful 5G Mate 60 series and robust brand reputation. These factors enabled Huawei to expand its market share significantly in the premium segment, where handset prices start at $600. US As of January, Huawei reported that over 200 partners had begun developing Harmony OS-based apps. The company aims to onboard 5,000 partners by the end of this year. Major enterprises involved in developing Harmony OS-based apps include Alibaba Group Holding, Michuan, Ant Group, JD.com, and McDonald's China. Harmony OS's rise to become China's second-largest mobile operating system marks a notable shift in the tech landscape. This achievement highlights Huawei's capacity for innovation and adaptability. As the industry watches closely, the ongoing impact of Harmony OS will shape future competitive dynamics and could lead to greater diversity in mobile operating systems. Stay tuned as we continue to follow this evolving story. What do you think Harmony OS's success in China means for the future of global mobile technology markets? Feel free to share your thoughts and perspectives in the comments section below. Don't forget to become a part of the Revel Discovery community by hitting that subscribe button to stay informed about the latest technological advancements and innovations. Explore endless tech possibilities for an exciting future.